Hey guys, how's it going? So it's been like almost two months now. Um, I did change my YouTube name. It's no longer my full name. Uh, I went with uh, Little Monster Comics. Uh, I chose that name because it was a name of a title of my video I did about seven, eight years ago with my son. He was running around with uh, an Eddie mask from Iron Maiden and, and he slipped it on. So I named that video uh, Little Monster, I think. Um, I thought it was cute. It is my watermark, uh, and it will be on the front page of the YouTube, whatever it is, <laughs> where you look at all my, my videos. Jesus Christ, it's been a while since I've done a video. Um, as you can see, it's a different background. This is my girlfriend's craft room, Sam. My craft room, Sam. Sam's craft room. And um, so, yeah, we I've been working on this room for, like, ever. And finally, we get it to a point where she really likes it you can tell it's all her Hulk stuff back there um a couple of uh, her favorite uh com uh comic uh covers you got Alex Ross uh, it's been a while Scotty Young <laughs> so you got Scotty Young Rack Rocket Raccoon you got uh Hulk Planet Hulk Planet Hulk there that's a Scotty Young and that is a Hulk number 11 but i don't know who the artist is but i really like that one that one's pretty badass and you got all her hulk stuff it's like most of her hulk stuff <laughs> there's there she is in the background right there but um yeah it's a cool little room it's a lot better than uh me using the other room that my son uses and i i, I think if she doesn't mind i think i might be using this room a little bit more for doing my videos um, so, um, comic book pickup. Now, we went out today, we picked up a bunch of stuff at the comic book store. My son really wanted to go. And that's another reason I haven't been doing too many videos, because he's been here for, like, almost the whole summer. So, it's been kind of hard trying to get everything. And getting money to buy stuff has been a pain in the ass. So, um, I said, screw it. Today, we went out. We He bought some figures. He bought a cool uh, DC uh, Superman that's from uh, DC vs vampires um so it's tr it's like a vampire superman he looks really badass and uh death metal batman which is pretty cool um if i can figure out my editing software i will throw a picture of what he got at the end of this because i don't know where he put them and i'm not gonna bother going grabbing them but they they are really cool i really love the vampire superman it looks badass um so let's get into the books now we found every single issue of Immortal Hulk that she is missing. And now she has the complete run of Immortal Hulk from zero to 50. Um, she doesn't have the first appearance of Immortal Hulk, but she does have number one. But it, the first appearance is a little pricey. Um, I don't remember what book that's from, but it can be a lot. So maybe, maybe I'll save up and find it and uh, that way she can have all her Hulk, Immortal Hulk books. But let's get into it. Uh, a couple of mine, then the rest of hers. We'll just go with the cute stuff first. Um, new series, Groot. So she's got Groot number two. There he is, the little bastard on the bottom there. And Groot three. Now, I this is a variant cover. Now, I'm not too sure if this is supposed to be um, Marvel because I have not read any of this series yet but it is only a four issue series so hopefully um i'll i'll read it oh, it's like four issues um the first issue is somewhere it, it was a scotty young cover which was nice to grab but um yeah we'll go with my stuff i got i got the amazing spider-man this is an annual this uh annual number one this is a variant cover with uh with black cat there you know i love my black cat um I don't know who did the cover. It's, um, I should have done my homework, but I really dig it. And this one, it goes through um, <sighs> Hollow's Eve and Ben Riley. Who is he now? I don't know who he is anymore. He's changed so much. But uh, at the end of Dark Web, uh, where, um, oh God. Ben Riley kind of gives up and he gets stuck in some sort of um, hell dimension. So Adam Eve's trying to break him out and Spider-Man kind of foils their plans. 
uh, it, I read it. It's not a bad, bad uh, issue. And there's a little um, kind of like seven, eight pages of um, uh, Mary Jane's aunt and her birthday. And there's a tie-in uh, with the X-Men title where X-Men are manufacturing medicine, I think it is. I have not read it, so I don't really know, but they're Krakoa medicine, and it drives people nuts, so her aunt's now crazy. I, I, I have no idea. No idea. But I was happy to get this. This is amazing, Spider-Man 31. Say what you want about the new Spider-Man run uh, with, um, oh, what what's his name? webs or whatever the hell his name is um i can just read who did this uh zeb wells zeb wells that's a weird name zeb wells i don't mind it i don't have every issue of the newest run uh, i don't have a problem with the new run i think it's all right for what it is everyone's bitching about spider-man and how stupid his the new run is well spider-man's been stupid for like decades and decades it's not like 80s was okay 90s was a shit show with the clone wars and whatnot like 2000s and up it, it was basically just ultimate spider-man you had to really read um because the the amazing line was shit so it's not like this is a whole new thing where it's like spider-man comics are horrible and no one reads them well have you ever read a spider-man comic have you ever read a comic what like besides maybe a 12 issue stint how many goddamn comics are actually good these days like barely anything and it's gets a series like something gets a series and all of a sudden it's done in six issues because no one's buying them so like who gives a crap if you want to read something read it. if you like it you like it you don't you don't but don't bitch about it all the time sorry <laughs> but uh yeah so amazing spider-man 31 this is a variant this is why i got that variant look at that the kitty with the spider ball but i really like this one i can't wait to read it. i think it's um uh tombstone's daughter's wedding i'm not too familiar because i've only here and there been buying the the new spider-man stuff so i can't wait to read it it's a thick boy too like what 25 was a thick one six was a thick one like they're going crazy with these thick issues i i don't I don't mind it. I love it. So, you know, hats off to Marvel if they want to do thick spider issues. And I can't wait to uh, get into it. I'm thirsty. Sorry. Uh, talking. Okay, so these are the issues of Mortal Hulk that Sam missed. So now she has all of the collection. So the reason I'm doing the video right now is because she wants to get the books, put them together, and look them up. So she's adorable. So here we go. These are all Alex Ross covers. They are not variants. We actually we actually found all of them today. So that was pretty good. A couple of them are pretty pricey and I don't know why. But um, here we go. So the Immortal Hulk Zero. I'm trying to not get the glare off the bag here. That looks pretty badass. Number eight. This was 12 bucks. This is a little pricey. Um, I have to look it up why it is, but... Uh, looks pretty cool. You got all the Hulk's parts in jars there. Number 13. This was a $10 book. It might be a first appearance of somebody. But again, I have no idea. But that is a pretty cool cover. I think that's Banner. Looks like it's Banner. Uh, this one's gorgeous. Number 14. I think number 14 is probably my favorite cover of all time. Like Banner and Betty... A nuclear bomb with Hulk in the background. Like, you can't go wrong with this. This is this is a gorgeous cover. I love it. Uh, number 15 looks like Doc Samson. Yeah. This is a pretty nice one, too. And number 18. Got the up-close face of the Hulk there. And last but not least, 42. I don't know why we never found a 42. Um, saw the variants. They weren't very, like, spectacular. Um, it might be the leader. This might be the leader. He might be in hell. I have no idea, but it looks pretty badass. So there it is. That's the last one. 
So no more Hulk, immortal Hulk. She's going to have to find something else to collect, which <laughs> it's going to be hard. But um, yeah, that's it. I wish I had more stuff, but the last couple of months has just been, there hasn't been anything in that we've been looking for. So hopefully um, this does it for you guys. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm trying to get back into this. It's so been so hard lately. Um, I still need to do a review of Something's Killed in Children book five. I Yes, five, because six just came out, which I didn't find. Damn it, I should have bought six today. Oh, well. <laughs> I'm going to kick myself in the ass for about that one. But, um, yeah. Um, again, this is me, just a new name for the channel. Um, I, I will be posting more, I swear to God I will. Um, do more reviews, more pickups. Uh, it's all about the money. I need the money to get the get the comics. <laughs> so then I can do the videos. But, um, yeah, let me know what you guys think of the, this little stack I got here. Um, throw me a comment. Uh, throw me a like if you want to. And if you have not subscribed, please do. Because I do appreciate it. And I do like the feedback. And uh, I will talk to you later, guys. Bye.